stopper. He came in and he's like, look at this Murano stopper. And I'm like, I know where the bottle is. That's so <laughs> cool. Right here. Today we're going to be revisiting an older video to see what sold, what I made a profit on, and what I probably could have left on the shelf. All right, well in today's video, we are here at Jacob's Warehouse, the other warehouse, which I introduced you to the last time I was in Ohio. Um, if you're not familiar with Jacob, um, he is Jacob of Burner Brothers Antiques channel here on YouTube. Make sure you go and check them out. I have George the Antique Nomad here with me. He's doing a little shopping, um, so make sure you go and check out his version of this this adventure um, but we're gonna do a little shopping today we're gonna make a little pile and we're gonna purchase some stuff out of the warehouse so here we go this is fun it was w william rogers no it wasn't rogers it was one I, had for I was wondering if that was a good one or not yeah that said at the house you mean yeah oh my yeah, gosh i love there. this so much um, what was it it was uh w Where did this pottery come from? Did you make this, Lucas? No, we Is this? I'll tell you where that's from. <laughs> I know where that pottery's from. I you, got that in Florida. You got that in Florida? Oh, I thought maybe that Lucas made this in school, and that's why he's laughing. He's like, no, I made that in art class. <laughs> I'll sell it to you. I think it's really cool stuff. I love it. Yes. It's weirdos. It's weirdos. It's a whole crate. A whole crate for all weirdos. Crate weirdos. Of weirdos. It's perfect. <laughs> and it's signed, even. Yes. You can't I, read I it. I actually packed those up in Florida and brought those here because I thought they were really cool. They are so cool. I think the dog is my favorite. That's the best. Wait, no, that wasn't Waverly really. Can I add these to my pile? Yes, 100%. In this building, like, I don't really, like, add as much as you want out of this building. What is this thing? Is that a... It's a giraffe? Well, I thought so, too, but it's got, like... It's Mythological creature. It does kind of, maybe it's a dragon. <laughs> You've got like a giraffe, but an elephant, a dog, a fish, and a dragon. <laughs> All right. All right, well, I found some pretty cool stuff on these shelves the last time, so I figured I'd poke around on the shelves. I like that raccoon. Walsh. Signed vintage art pottery, 1984. You like Raku? Ooh, that's pretty. Yeah, I, I brought that in Five feet apart. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. That's Thank amazing. You the the first thing I pick up. The first thing look, I pick Laurel, up. Look, Laurel. Daddy funny is fixed that? it. Yeah, he came in and he's like, "Look at this Murano stopper," and I'm like, "I know where the bottle is." That's so <laughs> cool. Right here. Oh Look at this. Wow. That's fancy. I like that. What do you think of this, Andrew? Look at this, Andrew. What do you think? Silver overlay? It's heavy. Heavy silver. What do you think, Laurel? She got beads. She's playing dress up. Look at her. She's pretty. Ceramic to Milano, Italy. I like that. All right, so we're kind of just looking every which way, seeing what we can find. Laurel found a puppy. She's very excited about that. Well, Mommy bought a whole bunch of weirdo pottery. Now you're moving your pile. You're just gonna keep moving it around. That's a fun time. Good job. I don't know what that means. Um, that's Outer Banks glass? What is OBG? I don't know why I'm drawing blank. I don't like it though. I think I actually looked at this the last time I was in the warehouse and I left it behind. OBG. I don't remember. Andrew just brought that out to me. I'll stick it in my pile. Oh, she's crawling. Oh, I gotta keep an eye on her. Hmm. I wonder what that mark is. I like it. 
I like the colors. What do we have over here? Germany. I like that. Those are metal. <laughs> Look at the little dachshund. I love him. And the owl is great too, so I'll add those to my pile. There's some House of Hatton. I found some of that at Goodwill the other day. And uh, I looked it up because I had found some of it. And I found it does fairly well. So I'm going to take this. And then I was eyeing up this vase or vessel. I don't know if it could even really be a vase because the hole's so tiny, but it's marked on the bottom. And it is marked L-E-H. So I'm going to grab that as well. I like that cool. Oh, yeah. Huh. That's really pretty as well. Well, that concludes our video of digging through Jacob's other warehouse. We are now heading down the road to the auction house. And we're gonna do a little bit of digging there, but you guys are gonna have to wait for that video um, and a special guest that will likely be showing up. But um, I guess we'll see all of you tomorrow. So long. If you enjoyed this video, we will be posting videos just like this every Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday. So make sure you stay tuned, make sure you hit the subscribe button, and I have included a link to the playlist down in the description.